Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you my updated wash day routine. In my previous video, I've done a pre-poo routine where I voted my straight hair back to curly. So today I'm going to show you the next steps in my wash day. So I'm starting by taking those twists down and rinsing out the conditioner. And as you can see, the curls are already popping. And once that's all rinsed out, I'm going in with the shampoo. Today I'm using this Faith in Nature shampoo bar that I got in my Treasure Chest subscription box. I'm applying the shampoo on my scalp only for the first time round and I'm giving it a good lather. This shampoo bar was okay, it wasn't too stripping but at the same time it did feel a little bit drying on my hair. So once that's all lathered up, I go in with my scalp massager to clean all that gunk off my scalp and to stimulate my roots. And I like to go in again afterwards with the pads of my fingers to make sure that I'm getting all of that gunk off my scalp because a healthy scalp environment will help your hair to grow. So once I'm done with the first shampooing, I go ahead and shampoo again. And I'm taking a shampoo all the way down my hair shaft this time, just to make sure every inch of my hair is clean. This is gonna help your deep conditioner to penetrate your strands and any other styling products you add to your hair as well. So your leave-in conditioner and your oils. So any healing properties or any moisturizing properties from those products are gonna penetrate your hair better because you got rid of all of those oils, butters, silicones, or whatever you put on your hair previously. You got all of that off, so it's able to penetrate the hair. So yeah, I'm just raking that shampoo through my hair. Don't really like to use a brush with shampoo. And once I'm done, I rinse it out, and my hair is looking clean and shiny at this point, and I love it. So next I'm going to go in with the deep conditioner. This is one of my favourite deep conditioners. This is the Camille Rose Agé Renew Deep Conditioning Mask. First of all it smells like mint chocolate ice cream which is my favourite and my hair absolutely loves it. It's very moisturising and it also helps to strengthen your hair as well. I'm applying the deep conditioner one side at a time and then I'm going to start the detangling process. So I just start by separating the hair in big chunks to get rid of the bigger tangles and then I start finger detangling before I go in with the brush or preferably a wide tooth comb because it's not going to be that tangled to need to brush again. Try to limit the brush use just because it has a lot of friction it's going to cause a lot of split ends and breakage so just try and brush your hair during detangling and that's it. So while I'm detangling with the brush if I run into any tangles and make sure to stop and use my finger to separate the hairs strand by strand to prevent any snagging or breakage and then I continue on once the knot is out. So even though I poo-pooed already, my hair does tangle up a little bit during the shampooing process. Once it's all detangled, I twist my hair up so it doesn't get tangled again and I repeat the same steps on the other side. And this is why I like to pre-poo. My detangling time in the shower is less than five minutes. Yes, five minutes guys. Once I'm done, I'll put a shower cap on and proceed with my shower. I like to do my exfoliation step and then rinse my hair out and then shower off my body once again to prevent any back knee and then leave that on for 30 to 45 minutes while I get ready and then I'll wash it out. So this is what my hair is looking like after I rinse it out and it's clean, soft, shiny and moisturized, ready to be styled. So yeah, there you have it guys. That's my super quick wash day routine. Is your wash day similar to mine? Let me know in the comments down below. If you enjoy the content, give it a thumbs up. It helps YouTube know that this is a good video and it will suggest it to other people. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.